Okay, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and good day. Okay, today uh, for this um, for this uh, video, uh, we continue uh, about uh, example number two for the topic number five, which is uh, torsion of circular shaft. So for the example number two, okay, you can refer into the textbook uh, mechanic of materials. Uh, example 5.7 okay the question asks you to to determine uh, the uh, the two solid steel shaft are coupled together using the mesh gear determine the angle of twist okay determine the angle of twist of n a of shaft a b when the torque is 45 newton meter is applied shaft AB is free to rotate within bearing E and F whereas shaft DC is fixed at D okay each shaft has a diameter of 20 millimeter take G to be 280 giga Pascal okay so what need you do is first you need to find the internal torque. Okay, how you how to find the internal torque from the free body diagram, and then you need to find the F. This one F. Okay, this one F, which is forty five divided by zero point one five meter equals to F equals to three hundred newton. Okay, and then you need to find the torque. Uh, so torque at D equals to 300 times 0 0.075 meter and then you can get torque at D is 22.5 uh, Newton meter ok next what need, what need you to do is uh, find uh, find the angle of twist ok so angle of twist ok you need to find using this formula okay theta c equals to tl dc divided by jg okay so angle of twist at c is 22.5 time length is 1.5 divided by j pi over d 0 0.001 to power of 4 and then g is 80 times 10 to power of 9 and then you can get Theta at C is 0 0.0269 radius, right? Okay, so since the gear at the end of the shaft are in mesh, okay, theta B 0 0.015 equals to 0 0.0296, okay, this one, uh, times 0 0.075, and then you can get the theta B is. 0.0134 right ok so since the angle of twist of NA with respect to NB of shaft AB caused by the top 45 newton meter and then you need to find the theta A should be equals to theta AB uh, sorry TAB uh, times LAB divided by JG and then TAB is 45 and the length is 2 divided by pi over 2 times 10 to uh, times 0 0.01 to power of 4 times G is 80 times 10 to power of 9 and then you can get theta AB equals to 0 .0, 0 0.0 right ok and then for the uh, rotation of NA is therefore theta A equals to theta B plus theta AB equals to 0 0.0134 plus 0 0.0716 equals to 0 0.085 right this one is the answer for this equation that's all thank you so much